First offering on its way. Well thrown sinker that time down but in the strike zone. The wind up and the 0 2 pitch. Hit to first. Thurman is there and he'll step on the bag himself and the inning is over. They go about their business a certain way. They make all the routine plays, mix in a few flashy ones, and day after day, they give their pitchers the best He's chance out. to be successful. And there's out number two. A native of Washington, the Evergreen State. He's a second-year big leaguer. Stu gloves it. Throw on to first, gets him, and the side is retired. Well, this is an approach we've seen him use effectively lately. Set up the inside and then get him out with pitches away. Fielder coasts under it. No trouble with this one, and the inning is over. Drilled right back up the middle. Ratto on the grass. And a close play at first, but a great stretch that time as they get him by a step for out number one. And this is not an easy play when you have to range to your right. He really didn't have a chance to get his feet set, so this is all arm. Nicely done. Hard liner, but picked up on a hop. And there are two away now. No runs, no hits, and no errors in the game for Toronto. And this is taken low for ball four, and they'll have themselves a two-out base runner here after all. Wow, that's a close pitch to take, but when you're a good hitter like this. And we'll have to leave it there as this is strike three, and that will retire the side. Blue Jays held in check. They trail it here three to nothing. Oh, and he's caught looking at a beautiful curveball there as that buckled him for the first out of the inning. So still nothing against him on the scoreboard Number here in the 10. fifth as we check out the league leaderboard for Team ERA. No runs, no hits, and no errors in the game for Toronto. Hit hard on the ground is short. Oh, and he can't come up with it. And the effort pays off as he's able to recover and get the second out of the inning. Fly ball out toward left center field. Dirtbag on the move. He's got it. A great running play, and that'll retire the side. Yeah, that looked like a strike, but let me tell you, when you're staring at a big zero in the hit column, getting a call like that to go your way can feel like a big victory. In there for extra bases, and there goes the no-hitter. And the Jays are in business now. It's a leadoff double. Wow, I was starting to wonder if we had to go on no-hit alert, Dan. I know you were privy to that. Sixth inning right here, they finally break through with their first hit of the game. And you have to wonder, Dero, this guy had been cruising all along going into this sixth inning. We'll see if he can be able to buckle down right here. No reason to give in to him here with the base open. Putting him on base just gives your defense more ways to help get you out of this. So they do get their first hit, but their first run will have to wait as the inning is over. Uh, trying to pick up that outside corner, but this misses, and it's back to even at two balls and two strikes. He executed that one-two curveball pretty well. I think it's right where he wanted it to end up, but he couldn't get him to chase at it. We'll see what they go with now after that didn't work out. Well, that's only the second hit he's given up tonight, and the first one didn't do any damage. So he's not sweating Number this one 10. at all. They haven't been able to string anything together. Pitch swung on and hit in the air toward the line and right, and that'll get down for a base hit. So now they'll have runners on the corners with two away. Hey, this might be their best opportunity okay. to at least get on the board. They've been struggling oh, offensively, and they find themselves with two runners on board. Let's see if they can continue. From the belt, kicks and deals. Oh, almost caught looking to end the inning, but it's called the ball, two and two. Well, that's what you want from your curveball on one and two. You start it in the zone and let it break out of the zone where it can't be punished. Didn't get him to go after it, but the execution was nice. Got him swinging in the dirt. Franchise is after it. And a good throw is in time, and they escape the jam. Smoke the other way. High and deep to left. Dirtbag going back. On the warning track, he makes the catch. The 2-2 one more time. 
A bouncer to the left side. Throw gets him. Two down. The 2-2. Two -two. Freezes him. A strikeout looking. Swing and a miss, and that'll get a groan from the home supporters here. One away. He's been in total control out there tonight. Number Gets the leadoff guy with a strike out there, and it just seems like we've seen so many off-balance swings and weekly hit balls in this one. Broken bat as this ball's hit on the ground. Throw on to first, and now the Jays are down to their final out. The oh, that'll make you the smile as a pitcher. Man. You make a Just good there. pitch. You, you blow the guy's Whoa. bat up, and then you make the play yourself. In your head, you're thinking, nice swing, meat. The 1-1 one, one home. Misses up and in. Well, when you're behind an account like this pitcher is, it's a good time to work in something off speed if you're confident in it. Most hitters are looking for fastball. Lackawalla is there to make the catch, and with that, the ball game is over. Yeah, and we knew he was in a groove from the first inning, and he just kept this thing rolling and rolling and rolling. They couldn't get anything going against him. A dominant performance with a complete game shutout. A 6 nothing shutout to finish off tonight's game. Boston get the win on the heels of four home runs. Gaylord Fielder gets to double digits with his 10th win of the year. And it's a dandy, a complete game, three-hit performance.